Daspadania, comrades. This is a review of Black Widow number one by the Soka Sisters, and it's also brought to you by Spirits Destiny number two. It's on Kickstarter. Check it out now. I'll post the link below. So let's get started with the review. Uh, the Soka Sisters are a uh, duo, obviously sisters, uh, of filmmakers. They've been making some horror movies, some twisted stuff like uh, American Mary. Uh, Marvel tapped them to work on Black Widow, which is pretty fantastic. I remember when I first heard this news, it was like, oh, they'd be great for that rated R Black Widow film. It's like, oh, no, they're doing the comic? Oh, okay, well, that's interesting. Let's go for that. Um, it is by an artist I'm not familiar with, uh, Flavorano? Uh, does that sound, what do you think? Flaviano? Flaviano. Flaviano. Oh, that's nice. Uh, never seen their work before. Absolutely love the art in this. Uh, it's essentially, it starts out with uh, Black Widow and Captain America trying to bust up a terrorist attack. The leader of the terrorists is dressed just like Captain America, which of course makes Steve not happy because he just dealt with this whole secret empire crap and is now trying to kind of rebuild his trust with the public. So this ain't helping. Uh, anyway, he enlists a Black Widow to help him out. And it's a super cool uh, pre-credits James Bond action sequence. Uh, it ends on a good note, but essentially it has a conversation between uh, uh, Black Widow and Steve about uh, the nature of being a superhero and a kind of assassin type of character she is and she's kind of walking that line so essentially she goes to kind of like uh kind of like uh let's see how should i put it uh get her groove on with killing uh she apparently also died and came back recently i have literally lost track of how many people have died and come back and in Marvel and DC lately. Uh, apparently she was killed by the fake Captain America and brought back by, I don't know, Jesus? Uh, is he a character in Marvel? I, he helped Ghost Rider that one time. Anyway, I'm sure that was it. Uh, anyway, she has gone to Madripoor uh, looking for work and she uh, comes across this character, Tiger Tiger, who is having... She's kind of like this sort of crime boss that's also... <sighs> kind of like an unofficial sheriff of uh, the country um, because like you know she isn't as corrupt and horrible as some of the other people at least as far as like the police and government of Matrapur. anyway she brings her in on this thing where uh, young women are being turned up missing and turning up on this website that's sort of like um, uh, it's sort of like that uh, uh, movie where you know hostile like, you know, people do terrible things to people, and they can afford to. Matter of fact, after looking at one of their videos, a uh, hardcore badass uh, Black Widow is disturbed by it. Uh, matter of fact, she goes and grabs a drink. Uh, <laughs> this is a person who has, like, done a lot of terrible things. Anyway, uh, so apparently she's going to go off... Uh, and start working on this problem, not before she encounters one of Tiger Tiger's, um, you know, adversaries of some sort. So we'll get to see where that's going. Uh, very good. I'm going to spoil this right now, but it's five out of five Ram Chips. Uh, I've never seen the Soka Sisters do a uh, comic book work before, but man, they kind of nail it. They do some references to some stuff uh, previous. Uh, they really have these characters down. Uh, the art is absolutely gorgeous. The coloring looks beautiful. Um, not sure who this artist is. I've never seen their work before, but I am really excited by it. It's got some kind of old school 70s Marvel plus maybe uh, anime kind of, at least an, uh, an anime or animation style uh, vibe to it. Uh, otherwise, I really, really like this. This is a really good start. I just picked this up just because I was curious what the Soka Sisters would do with Black Widow. And yeah, uh, I'll be honest, I'm not 100% sure if this is an ongoing or mini. I think it's an ongoing, and well, whatever many they produce, I'm going to buy these. This is really good. Uh, good first start. Uh, what did you, did you pick this up? What did you think? Uh, leave a comment below. You can hit me up on my various social media platforms like Twitter and Facebook. Uh, Red Knight Comic is also on Facebook, and you can support this channel at Patreon. And don't forget, uh, currently, the uh, Spirit's Destiny 
<clears throat> uh, the Spirit's Destiny, excuse me, I can't talk. The Spirit's Destiny Kickstarter is live right now. Go support it or show it to people you think can support it. Whatever you want to do. Uh, tell them Mano sent you, by the way, if you support the book. Push the button, Lindsay.